You know what it is. This your boy Flo Rida. You know, shout out to Music and Conversation with my girl, Shannon Cook. Do you like connecting with your fans oh, via the definitely. internet? Oh, yeah. I, I go on MySpace. Actually, you could go to my official flow website, which is official, officialflow.com. Mm -hmm. It'll take you to my MySpace page, Facebook, and the Twitter page. And then I take it even further by giving out my cell phone number, which is 305-528-2786. That's 305-528-2786. Holla at your boy. Are you kidding? Is that yeah. seriously your cell phone number? Yeah. You want thousands and millions of it's people to call you? Of course. If they can go out and buy my albums, I can at least make the sacrifice to holler at the few people who call. You know, a lot of times I'm busy, so they'll get my voicemail. And if I can speak to them and I have time, I always text back because I think that's very important. What percentage of those calls or texts get a response? I mean, I mean out of 100%, I would say at least 30%. Really? Yeah. That's not bad. Hello? Yeah, this is your boy Florida. What's good? What's your name? Hello? You can hear him laughing in the background. Yeah, this Florida was good. What's your name? You forgot your name? You, you, you actually on CNN Live right now because you called my phone. In your song, Right Round, you sample the 80s group Dead or Alive. Dead or Alive yeah. Are you a fan of 80s music or you just like that song? I mean, I grew up, you know, Seven Sisters, so I listen to all types of music. Mm -hmm. And Dead or Alive was one of the records in particular that I've heard. Mm -hmm. um, but my a and and Mike Karen actually brought it to my attention. Me putting out a sophomore album, I thought, you know, I brought my horizons, show people my growth. So I got in the studio with Dr. Luke, mm -hmm. who's the producer of the song, and, you know, we made history. <laughs> Your first hit song, Low, broke yeah. digital sales records. How did that change the pace of your career? I mean, most definitely that we had to hurry up with the album and put it out, you know, because we definitely mm -hmm. want to keep the attention on, you know, the fact that we have a number one record and, um, you know, let that follow into having a number one album. I right. mean, definitely happy for the fact that on this album versus the last, there's more substance. So at the same time, the fans get a feel of me, you know, where I come from, mm -hmm. how I got the success, as well as me being the life of the party, you know. Cold, money, yeah. more What's your real name? My real name is Tramar Dillard. What does your mom call you? She called me Tramar. Okay. My she doesn't call you name. She doesn't call you Flo? When she's playing around, she's like, hey, Flo Rider. What does Florida mean to you? Oh, Florida, it means the world to me. I mean, I, I wouldn't change it, you know, growing up. Me especially growing up in Miami, I mean, I've been everywhere. Love it, but it's no place like home. You got the hot beaches, you got the, a gumbo of different cultures, you know, from um, Dominican, Puerto Rican, Cuban, Haitian, mm -hmm. you know, Jamaican, all of that, you know, so it's all different types of food I can enjoy. You know, I can enjoy the sun, I can enjoy the hot girls. You hot yourself, baby. I can't you know. even tell what you're looking at. <laughs> I can't see any eyeballs. Oh, I know you're jealous of the girl in my glasses, huh? <laughs> Down to the penny, holla if you hear me. I do it for the streets, yeah, I do it for my city. <laughs> Very nice. Mm -hmm.